of the future uh, the past must be left behind for tomorrow is the beginning of new era the road to a new dream what is today will soon be part of the past but the future of tomorrow is something that has to be envisioned how our country will obtain total sustainability to ensure our own future success these are the ideas leading in the direction of my dreams. The dream of elevating the lives of many Filipinos that live beyond unimaginable condition. We are living in a country of uncertainty. The only certain to our fellow Filipino or among Filipino is death. Many unanswered questions are on the minds of many Filipinos. It is time for change. I want to focus on the solution to the problem of our country by cultivating the resources that are available today. Tapping into the political, technological, agricultural, economical, and social changes in our society. This will lead us toward advancement. We must gain equal right and have mutual respect for each other. No rich, no poor. No high or low, we must all enjoy the fruits of our labor today. My dreams is my purpose, to offer the rest of my life, to reform the lives of many Filipinos. We must adjust to the, to the changing times, yes. We cannot live in hibernation without growth and development in every sector of our society. Let us create together a national unity working, helping each other, sharing what we have more to those people who have less. We are now struggling for equality and of course opportunities. I promise that is available for everyone soon. You know, the rich and the powerful politicians always grab more than they needed. The poorest and disadvantaged citizens seldom receive the benefits. I will introduce the evolution and the innovation, hoping to work some leaders of our country to do better, to improve businesses and environment. Eradicate corruption, disruption so our community will rise to the new height of success. It is time to change our governmental ways of leadership. Now is the time to work together, to reach our common goal, to make our country achieve the basic needs for all. Stimulate the individual control of everyone's future and the future of this nation. I said from the beginning that these are my dream, but my hope is that these are your dreams too. Let's accomplish this goal for the future of this nation. I stand before you today, tomorrow, and to all generation and generation to come, that I will do my pledge to the best of my ability to fulfill my cause for the welfare of all people in this country. I feel the grief and dismay in my heart. I cannot digest seeing people dying from hunger, malnutrition, diseases, and total inhumane living condition. It is time that someone take charge 
and lead this nation. Let's go and be proud to be Filipino. Love one another and love your country. This is my message to everyone. Do not give up. There is life ahead of us. Again, Francis Leo Marcos po, hindi magnanakaw, subok na makatao, at lalong hindi trapo. Bagong mukha ng Senado para sa tunay na pagbabago. Diba? Madali lang bumoto. Mahalaga ang iyong boto para sa nais mong pagbabago. Para sa ligtas na pagboto, sundin lagi ang health and safety protocols. Gusto mo bang malaman ang wastong paggamit ng vote counting machine sa darating na halalan? Nais mo rin bang malaman ang proseso ng tamang pagboto? Ang COMELEC ay nagsasagawa ng voters' education at VCM demonstration para sa iba't ibang grupo at organisasyon. Maaaring ipadala ang inyong request sa VCM demo at votesafe.com. Limang araw bago ang nakatakdang aktibidad. Paano nga ba bumoto gamit ang vote counting machine o VCM? Pagkatapos mapatunayan ng Electoral Board ang iyong pagkakakilanlan, ay iaabot na sa iyo ang secrecy folder, marking pen, at ang iyong balota. Suriin mo ng maigi ang iyong balota. Siguraduhin na wala itong maraka, kunit, o kahit na ano pa mang dumi. Fill upan ang iyong balota gamit ang marking pen. Itiman lamang ang bilog katapat ng iyong napiling kandidato sa bawat posisyon o party list. Tandaan, mahi... Norma TV Your humanitarian channel